me. So I have one, two, three, four, five left. And then she got Wow. He was like awesome, dude. Duck kill bears. Instead of hiding from death, Sam seemed to go out of his way to meet it. That was interesting. After Sam died, my mom and Edie got really close. They'd both lost a lot. Can I get through here, please? That makes sense. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to get this game done. Dear Kay, do you remember the way Gregory used to laugh? when he thought he was alone. Hmm. Like, something funny was happening, but only he could see it. I can feel it in my bones. Something weird is gonna happen. I think he saw things the rest of us don't. Oh, he was a magical or... I don't know, honestly. I'm controlling the frog, oh my god. I wonder what he saw. Oh my god, I have like schizophrenia or something. What his world was like. <laughs> or I'm just a child, that might also be it. <laughs> this, is so, this is like easily the most fun part of this entire game. You reminded me so much of Calvin. What is happening? Are they following? They're going in a circle. Imagination. Whatever it was he saw. It sure made him happy. <laughs> this is so weird. I mean, I love it. So wild. He was slipping away. Sorry about that, Gregory. I know you did everything you could. Well, what happened? I had uh... Damn it. Hold on, I don't want Gregory hmm. to hear this. This is gonna turn not too good. Oh, I can still control the frog. Hail. I wish you could have yeah. 
about the world he saw. And here I go. So I don't know how to swim. There's so much I don't understand. About Gregory. Well, that was the most fun part of this game, and it's what the heck? Am I the, I'm the frog now. Jesus Christ. I am not a frog. This is just one big freaking dream or something. I know what happened wasn't your fault. Did any of you just see that? Like, is it or is it just like the child just died and now I am a frog? I'm sure it's happening. And now I'm getting sucked down into this drain. Which is just awesome. Wow. Good luck, Kay. Y'all just saw that, right? It's just oh, me. Sam. Or did... Man, this is getting like more messed up. Fill in that one. Imagine my mom ever writing poetry. Another one. Yet. A poem this for Gus, good. who always said the wedding was a bad idea. Oh no! What does that mean? Oh no! Ooh. Ooh. I just cracked my back. That was Our father wonderful. never hits kids. At least not very hard. I'm sorry about before that, Mike. Before the day my guys. mother said with teenage just, like, disregard that back. he'd be dead I before he'd see a right. wedding in our yard. He said he'd be dead before he saw him. I try to fly a kite. Yep. That's pretty much the whole point of this, I think. Okay, cool. It's, or it's kinda cool. I don't want to supposed to be dead. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Come, of course, but Gus stood far apart, just flew his kite and bottled up the seed's heart. What does that even mean? That's not. Oh, whoa, this is freaking cool. I tried this to game talk is him sweet. Out of it, though he'd never met her. We don't need a stepmom, were the words that I. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You make him cry. <laughs> Any other words that I have to do? Or am I just ignoring a wedding ceremony right now? I'm just ignoring a wedding ceremony, that's pretty cool. Why does it matter the words that you remember? There's gotta be something else for me to do in this situation, right? Yay! Time for Wild. photos came, Dad ordered him to come, come here. here. But Gus declined, and as a sign held up his middle finger. <laughs> the wind picked up, and panicked geese appeared and quickly went. But all the humans did that day was go inside the Well, I played with my kite, and the rain, and I'm gonna get struck by lightning. Rain came down in buckets then, but no one seemed afraid that Rich. nature might destroy the tent our dad had crudely made. Whoosh. Whoosh. See, this is kind of fun. What's with all these rhymes and such? How is this one going to answer? I feel like it's going to get struck by lightning or something, but maybe I'm supposed to take all of this stuff over to the tent and just, like, chuck it at it. I don't know, I'm just collecting things. The thunder like, sounded you know. much too close and full of angry power. But all my father said to this was, make the music louder. Oh, genius. I wish that. I wish the flood. What do you wish? 
I'm just flying my kite out in the friggin' storm. Like a genius child, you know. Collecting chairs to have flabby. I don't even know, honestly. This is a strange, strange game. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. And I think I have all the chairs and stuff behind me. So what am I supposed to do? There's no, like, other words in the sky, are there? That was lightning. That's, like, all metal, isn't it? Yeah, this guy, I think I have a feeling. And having anything done. What do you wish? See, that's the question. I keep just flying this room. What do you guys think? Check tell me out. I could use some help. Like, real help. What do you guys think I have to do? Chat helped me out of a pretty desperate situation earlier. Maybe you guys can do it again. Probably 20 minutes of wandering around the stupid house trying to figure out what was going on. And the chat just kind of gave me the answer. Oh, there we go. Never mind, I got it. You guys don't need to help. Oh, he got smushed by the, he got smushed by the tent. I wish that I could truly say I thought about you on that day. Out there on the beach alone. Just you, the wind, the sea, and foam. Jesus. But I didn't. Wow. Until we found you. Hmm. That was... Okay. She never talked about him, but Mom told me once if I was a boy, they were going to name me Gus. So this family tree is going to be what remains of Edith Finch. It's a little weird situation they got going here. My mom moved up to or the loft after her brothers one. died. <clears throat> At the time, it was as far away as she could get. Oh no, there's going to be another fever dream or whatever. Whatever these flashback things are, I don't know. Yeah, I'm playing on Xbox. I always stream on Xbox. I don't have a PC. She spent a summer building houses in Calcutta, where she met my dad, Sanjay. Calcutta? Religion was Are another we? thing my mom never talked about, but I think it helped her a lot after her dad died. Yeah. Why? My mom moved to India a week after graduation and got a job teaching English. Oh. Lewis was born a year later. <sighs> when my dad died, I don't Let's think mom knew where else to go. I'm sure Edie was happy to have her back. The house had to get a little bigger, but family. Edie was used to that. Um, I play with, I mean, me and Sager Discord together, but we and actually for a while, never got to get things together. Were good. We've been trying to for a long time. But it didn't last. Like, multiple weeks. We've been trying to get together and play some. The beginning was Milton's 10th but... birthday, when Edie gave him a castle. This. After Milton disappeared, the only thing he left behind was a room full of paintings. Oh, so Milton is gone. Like, disappeared. Presumed dead. But it's unclear. That was like kind of rhymy, wasn't it? Can I go in? Thank you. What's this thing? Oh, that's cool. So someone made a memorial. Milton Finch in all of the magic people. paintbrush. Actually pretty sweet. I don't play either of those games, but me and Sage were gonna play Dead by Daylight at one point, but at this point I've moved forward toward Apex 2K. 
play in um, RPGs like this. Oh, it's blanking out. I was four when Milton disappeared. Wow. So now there's only two more. No, three. Mom spent months searching for my brother. Then she sealed the doors. Why is she sealing the doors? There's got to be an explanation for that. That's the thing I don't understand. Whatever Milton had found in the house, Mom didn't want it getting out. Mom definitely blamed Edie, but I think Lewis blamed himself. After he graduated, he spent more and more time in his room until Mom the cannery. Everyone was in Lewis's room, Ooh. except Lewis. <laughs> See a picture, so that was like before it was like a real thing. Oh, that's sweet. That, that would have been great. Say. This place is sweet. That is... Lewis's room smelled very, very oh, familiar. That part of him lived on. Dear Mrs. Finch, as Lewis's psychiatrist, I can understand your desire for an explanation. As I see it, the trouble began in January, shortly after we convinced your son to seek treatment for substance abuse. Newly sober, I believe Lewis first noticed the monotony of his daily life. He kept working at the cannery. But he withdrew part of himself. In sessions, I saw the same behavior. His oh, mind yeah, began to. Get to blood. Wonder. I asked Heck. him to describe it. He said he started small. Imagining a labyrinth. He'd feel his way about. <laughs> then something moved. Bats. Bones. He like knew it was hate. He took it very seriously. I had hoped he'd. Instead. Instead, he lost himself. But he found something more. I worried about him then. Daydreaming at the cannery. I spoke with his boss. Lewis had become a model employee. Methodical, tireless, focused. Like a whole new Lewis. So I let him go on. Plan. 
I even in It seemed very promising at first. This is weird. Me he'd made a new friend. It's like imagining. On the edge of like a city a he named Lewis Topia. He built the city up slowly, brick by brick. Then he made musicians. This is freaking fun. And songs for them to play. He talked about starting a band. He was always humming something. Every day his imagination grew stronger. Fish. He no like longer spoke at the loosely around a fish. But his chopping was as reliable as ever. Then one day it struck him that all the cheering crowds, even the stones under his feet, were all in his imagination. So he could do whatever he wished. Oh dear. He held an election for mayor. And he won. Wow, really? They begged him to stay, but his mind was already wandering. It became a game for him. <laughs> He'd conquer a city, then immediately push on. New Lewisville. St. Louis. <laughs> he started drifting away from our reality. What is this one going to be? Minneapolis, until one day he forgot to go home from the cannery. Even as his mother pleaded with him, part of Lewis kept sailing on. Doesn't matter. I don't care about her. Doesn't matter. I got some conquering to do. I started driving a stupid boat. In Lewisburg, he heard rumors of a. Handsome queen. I guess that's pretty um, proactive, actually. It's pretty dope. Good job, small game developer. Whoever made this, I don't even know. There's no way something like Triple A game to have made this. The queen was on her own quest for. Radiant rainbows, obviously. Radiant Jeez. rainbows. Silver hearts. It's a much more soothing sound than silver heart. Well, I have to drive over there. Well, His chase led him to a golden palace east of the sun and west of the moon. Even then, his logic remained sound. He knew the world was what? all in his imagination. Yeah, fish. But he was so of proud of having created it. In like his own person. eyes, he'd become something great.
normal person would have like the rest of them. For someone who'd never known success in the real world, I think it was overwhelming. And then it struck him that the real Lewis was not the one chopping sand, but the one climbing the steps of a golden palace. Oh, awesome. So we just completely lost our formality in this battle. My imagination is as real as my body, he told me. It was hard to argue with him. What's he do? He began to forget the world we know. I think it pained him to remember Lewis, the cannery worker. Is that? That's what he did. He began to despise the man with a royal contempt. That is me. I still thought I could save him. Oh. Oh. Even after he said he was being crowned king over all the lands of wonder. Cool. The palace would be packed with his companions. I don't know what's gonna happen, but it's gonna be messed up, so your discretion advised for what's about to happen, because I feel like it's gonna get chopped up in a little piece or something. Including the wise Calico who insisted on advising him. Your son was a kind man who will be missed by all of us who knew him. Why? Why do they just... They're all so crazy. This is just like a long list of people who have died really dumb or gruesome My brother death. was really cool. I wish you could have met him. <laughs> 